Um, Mark Andreessen was interviewed yesterday, and he made a comment that uh, he sees companies doing a lot more acquisitions due to the falling valuations and a lot of private companies scrambling over the next you know, 12 to 24 months. What is your take on that? Do you, do you, is There's this a, a time to buy or is this a time well, to wait? I, I don't think I'm the right person to give you investment advice. I think um, there's a lot of evidence that there is a slowing of things. Um, it's true globally, by the way. It's not true just in our industry. But my venture capital friends say that uh, valuations are somewhat down. Um, there's not been as many exits as people thought there would be. Um, no one knows how long these periods go. But I will tell you one interesting thing I have learned during these periods is this is when the strong companies get stronger and the weaker companies have trouble. And so the tough times in many ways benefit entrepreneurs who are capable of wiggling, if you will, to get the revenue that they need to hold it. And they learn incredibly important lessons in difficult times. It's so much tougher to be a, a successful entrepreneur when you're under a lot of revenue pressure than when money is flowing at a very high rate, which it has been for the last few years. And the last few years have been uh, abnormal with respect to the leverage of the entrepreneurs over venture capitalists in terms of the negotiations. And we may be returning to a more balanced period, and, but no one really knows. Um, and I would defer to Mark's other comments because he lives in that space. Sure. Um, uh, do you think with and with, you know, it's, it's kind of a mixed signal, right? Because you have these kind of negative uh, uh, signals and some slowing investment. And yet you see these firms raising billion-dollar funds. Again, this has happened in Q1, Q2. It's ha it's not, that, it hasn't slowed down. That I can't comment on. I yeah. think sometimes the, one of the things about these capital investment cycles is sometimes you get misalignment where money is being spent where money shouldn't be spent or money is being raised too soon. It can also be a case where the opportunities are phenomenal and not enough money is being raised. So they may get slightly out of alignment over, over a long enough period of time. It does, it does straighten out. Um, in Google's case, we have made a decision to significantly increase our investments in Google Ventures here in Europe as well as in, uh, as in America because we've done so well in our investments. It's been so strategic both financially as well as strategically it's worked. So we may be a counter signal to that. In other words, we may be one of the few that's, that's going to continue to invest pretty heavily.